Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 898, where we have 40 moves to collect 72 jelly and reach 300,000 points. I'm a little concerned about the points on this level when I normally am not, just because it's so high up on this meter board, it looks like it might be a little bit tough for us. Let's look at this board. I've got UFOs, which are really helpful. They're right now in these licorice bands. If there's any frosting, which there's just a little on this board, but if there's any left when I... I um, open this up, it's going to hit these frosting. Uh, and then we've got these sugar chests, so we have these sugar keys we need to unleash. I want to do that first. I want to open everything up before I concentrate on the individual jelly I need to remove. I need to remove all of the barriers first. Now we also have chocolate spawners, not too worried about those. I can usually take care of most of the chocolate just by making other moves that I need to make anyway. So, okay, so we're almost ready to open these up. Here we go. And now I have a few more specials that I can use, hopefully, to target this area. I do want to take out the chocolate before it consumes my special I work to make. Let's see. Now stop it. The other thing I'm hoping is if I get one of the UFOs opened, it will set off all the other UFOs. I do worry about the chocolate a little bit when it starts to impede my progress. But I'm really focused on seeing if I can make a special that can hit this. I figure the central one is the easiest one to reach, so that's the one I'm looking most closely at. Uh, when I can't do anything spectacular, I'm making moves low to the ground so that I can encourage some cascading to hopefully take out this chocolate and maybe uh, create some other movement. Like the spontaneous creation of the specials I need. That would be good movement. Yeah, unfortunately, running out of moves to make, potentially going to get a shuffle up, Love to move that over. Here we go. Now, if I could detonate that where it stands, that would be awesome. Wow. This looks like the only move I have available. Ah, we're getting close. We could almost get that yellow gone. Maybe. Come on. Here we go. This has got to work, right? Finally. So let's see in the remaining seven moves if we can clear everything out. I know it seems like a long shot, but we have the power of these UFOs. And they're going to really help us so much with what we need to do. Oh, I was so hoping it would get that last UFO. Well, we don't have to reach the UFO in order to clear out this level. So if we still can't get to it, not a problem. What I'm going to do is take out this jelly because it's right close to this spawner. I can't see if it gets consumed. So I'm trying to make sure that I take it out before it becomes an issue. Now I'm going to take out all red. And then it must be that the last one is under here. I don't think I saw it under there. So now I'm realizing I do need to take out this UFO. So I think the best way to do that in this limited amount of time I have if I take out all green and concentrate these colors and create a spectacular... Oh, there we go. It must have been under here and I just didn't see it. Uh, if I create some spectacular um, chaos, then sometimes that'll help me to solve it. So a little bit of luck there, not going to deny it. That was my first time through, but I think I got a little bit of luck toward the end there. If you want some luck, bring in some boosters and that'll help you. If you want to see more videos, you can subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.